Hey guys, it's Nick and welcome back to another Zelda video. Now this one is going to be a little bit of a throwback to a video I released um, pretty much a year ago, 23rd of December 2016, um, and it's kind of blown up a little bit. And by a little bit I mean it like is probably about 70% of the views on my channel, so I kind of thought it was time to uh, just have a look back on, on how that video got made and um, kind of try and figure out why it blew up so well. So I'm going to spam you with my intro and then I'm going to tell you a little bit more about it. So I'm making this video in response to a video I've posted in the past that's really blowing up at the moment. And of course I'm speaking about the video titled Creepy Music Box Plays a Zelda Song. So the reason why I'm making this video is um, basically the video I'm talking about did blow up a lot and um, I'm still scratching my head trying to understand why it's happened. I'm really grateful to everyone who's clicked on it and watched it, everyone who's enjoyed it and said positive stuff about it. It's been awesome. Um, so thank you for coming along and those of you who stayed along for the ride and subscribed, um, I, re I really appreciate that as well because I don't really do this for money. I don't do this for um, for anything other than just for entertainment for myself. So it's interesting to see the, the channel growing organically as well. So thank you guys. So um, basically, I'll, I'll talk a little bit about why I've decided to make this. Um, there's been a few people who have commented thinking that it's fake or that I've staged it somehow, um, which I wish I could do that because then I could do a lot more videos. Um, I also would have gone for something a lot darker as well if I could have staged it. But anyway, what I'll do in this video, I'm actually going to play the original footage unedited so you can see how it fit together. I kind of cut it up and chopped it around a little bit just to make it a little bit more suspenseful so you'll see uh, that as well um, and basically yeah I guess <laughs> this is just to dis disprove that it is fake. So basically the scenario was that we were heading away on Christmas holiday and we'd stopped over at my in-laws for a night just to sort of break up the trip so we'd stopped off at his house he has a whole bunch of toys and stuff from when um, my wife and her siblings were young so the kids had got those out and they're playing with them and um there was this creepy music box and the kids were playing with it and I was like hey that that sounds like the song of soaring and that's what I heard so I was like maybe I'll um, whip out my camera and make it a quick you know one minute video the reason behind that was at the time uh, Breath of the Wild had just been announced for the Nintendo Switch and there was news that I think had just come out a few days before that they were going to do a Nintendo Direct in January. In anticipation of that, uh, websites like Zelda Informer or Zelda Dungeon, um, and they were featuring all sorts of stuff like artwork for Breath of the Wild and things like that. So I, my thinking was if I can get this video across to them somehow and they see it, it's a quick video, it doesn't have a lot of like a big investment to watch it and then if they featured that it might link people back to other videos I was making about Zelda and um, get some subscribers to watch when I got Breath of the Wild and did some Let's Plays. That whole thing fell over <laughs> so that never really happened um, but it was something I still enjoyed doing. It was a, a big learning experience for me as well learning how to use those tools to make a Let's Play video. Um, so that was quite exciting. But yeah, that's the motivation behind it is I was going to make this quick video, send it to Zelda Informer and be like, hey, check out this and maybe you guys will by accident see the rest of my channel and I'll get some sort of, note, you know, some sort of recognition. I wasn't doing this for any monetary gain. I, I still don't have the video monetized even though it's gone over 200,000 views today. And that might sound crazy to some people and they, you might think that um, I'm an idiot for giving up what could be, I don't even know how much money that equivalents to, I, I don't really care, I'm just doing this for fun. And I don't want to monetize it for my own reasons, and I, I guess if I could describe that to you it's just, I don't want to feel like I'm making money out of something that should be enjoyment for everybody. Plus I don't want to stick like a 30 second ad at the beginning of a one minute video, that's just ridiculous. So anyway, as I was deciding to make this video, um, I was playing the music box over and over and my daughter just sort of walked past and said, can you stop playing that? It's going to give me nightmares. And I really wanted her to say that in the video, um, just to give it a bit more of an airy feel. Uh, and I guess it's just, it aligns with that whole dark, um, you know, the dark feeling behind Majora's Mask where the song features. So I was trying to get her to say it the way she said it again. So I just kind of had the camera out and I said, what did you say would happen if we played this music box? Uh, and I was kind of coaxing her into saying how she said it before but children never say the same thing twice and I didn't really want to you know push her there and stand there for hours saying say the line say the line so I, I wanted it to be natural and, and just um how she'd done it before um and she was kind of saying the line and then um 
a bird, boom, flew into the window just as um, as we were recording it. And I had a million things going on. I was meant to be packing the car, meant to be getting the kids ready. To, and um, I was trying to quickly get this line into the video so I could edit it on the way up. And as I was um, driving up and going through the footage, I was actually like, you, you know what? I've just realized what the song of soaring actually does. So I was like, okay, I'll chuck that in. And I was also working on a project where I'd used the song Manipulated Living um, from the Donnie Darko movie, uh, from the soundtrack. And that just has this really dark, you know, this really dark bassy sound to it and I was like you know that's that's gonna be really good I'll put that in as well normally I would have found some creepy Zelda music and chucked it in but I just didn't have internet access I wanted it to be ready and when we get to the hotel we'd just upload it this, this is uh, such a lazy effort for me um, I, I literally spent about half an hour making this for if I was to cut up all of the little segments of filming the um, editing and then the actual uploading onto YouTube um, I was so lazy with it that I actually left the thumbnail as a, a shot from, like a suggested shot from within the video. Um, I meant to come back retrospectively and, and change that, like I have with some other videos. And then after after seeing its success, I kind of ironically went, I'm just, I'm going to leave it as it is. Um, and it's, can, I don't know, maybe that's part of its charm, but it, it keeps it blowing up. So We ended up stopping in Waiuru at a friend's house and uh, just said hey can I use your internet really quickly I'm going to chuck this up and um, it's probably going to get 100 views maybe two or three likes and um, yeah that would be the end of it and for me at that stage that was that was success you know um, I'm just a small channel I, I still consider myself a small channel and, and I was like that's going to be a really good success for me only recently have I noticed that it hit 100,000 views only within the last um, week or so and now today it's at 200,000 so I thought I'd put together this video, uh, show you guys what the footage was like unedited just so you can see that um, I haven't deceived anybody, maybe I have a little bit. Um, I was actually dismissive of the bird when it happened, so um, yeah, I probably could have gone around, you know, got some footage of some gravel crunching underfoot trying to find the body of the bird just to make it a little bit creepier, but at that at that time I didn't even think I was going to use that part, I was like, oh damn it Jasper, just spoken up and ruined what your sister's gonna say but uh, it all worked out well in the end so that's good uh, so without further ado let's play that original footage what's this gonna do see ya mate see ya have a good one yeah you too and um, see you about Wednesday or something so Mia's yeah yeah alright <laughs> see you mate alright bye Santa Jasper bye. Jasper bye. what's this gonna do what's this gonna do Sina Did a bird fly into the window? I flew and then it just fell down. What's, um, a, what's this gonna do, Sienna? It will make a it will make a nightmare if you if you put it next to your ear while you're asleep and play it. And, and it would be creepy. And I and I thought it in my ear and and then was all my ideas was. Do you know? Yeah? Don't do it tonight, Sienna. Um, but anyway, we're not going to be having this like over here. We'll be at the end of the And that's all there is to it, really. Um, just a, a couple of clever camera tricks from me um, some terrible narration in the car when I was meant to be um, checking the water and that was my most successful video basically produced within the space of half an hour so that's all I have to say about the original post um, I hope that hasn't been too earth shattering for people that the, the bird didn't try to murder us or it wasn't an omen of death or anything like that um, but I just want to thank you guys again for your support um, for watching the video for those of you who have clicked subscribe afterwards I really appreciate that um, I don't make any money from it I don't like I said before I don't have any gain from that aside from having a, a good feeling at the end of the day chances are if you are watching this you've probably found me because of the Zelda content um, I do other stuff as well but if you want to check out my channel I do have a, a ton of Zelda videos theories speculation etc um, and then I've got some stuff that isn't really Zelda related all sorts of stuff as well you, you wouldn't you wouldn't you wouldn't believe how many how many things there were on there unless you saw it and then you'd be like actually that's yeah i'm just i'm just going off now <laughs> um but yeah that's that's all from me have a wonderful evening 
um, unless you're not watching this in the evening, um, in which case have a good day, but then afterwards have a good evening as well. Um, and if you're watching this in the morning, have a good morning and day and afternoon and evening uh, and just keep that cycle going. Just keep going with that and um, then eventually after you've had maybe seven or eight of those, another video will be up from me and you can click that and, uh, and then you can call me a piece of shit in the comments <laughs> or you can, uh, you can like it and, and keep watching them and, and maybe we have a mutual beneficial relationship where you guys watch videos and I make videos and, uh, and, and that's, that's basically it. I'm, I've gone on too long now. Thank you for watching. Have a good night.